All right, everyone pay attention. Giovanni, the god, or shell is up. It's a 1-1 game in the top of the six, and he takes ball one. Great take by him. Funkhauser's on the bump. Here comes the second pitch of the at-bat. Breaking ball. Fouls it down the third baseline. So we're at one and one now. Next pitch. Nice pitch, Funky. One and two is the count. Giovanni, which no one calls him. We just calls him Gio. Fouls that one back. Count is one and two. Next pitch, it's high. Great eye. Two and two. Now we go one more pitch. Now that's fouled back. Just staying alive. Staying alive. Ah, ah, ah. Yeah, staying alive. Another foul ball. The count remains two and two. The next one. Fouled back again. Geo having himself in that bat. Trying to get the leadoff runner on in a tie game late. Ball three. Geo says, yeah, I've done it. I have walked. And he runs the first base and no one stops him. And the pitcher just keeps going. And Glaber, the on-deck circle, he just starts walking to the plate and both managers don't say anything. And what the hell is that? That was three balls. Now, I think the one-two pitch is the cause for all the confusion because look how the umpire reacts. He doesn't throw both hands up and say foul ball. He just kind of raises that left hand while searching for a new ball. And I don't know if that's an official motion or not. But I think this is the cause for all the confusion because what if that umpire called that a ball, not a foul ball, and then he was yelling and showing a different count the entire time? That may be the case because look at this. It's on its way. It's on its way. At this point, you'd be like, wow, how is he going to catch up to that? He's pretty behind. And then the barrel comes around and, and then this next frame is the weird one. So it looks like he hit the ball there. Looks like it never reached the glove. But one thing's for certain, the umpire sure shit can't see that, especially how fast it's going. The glove's in front of his face. So maybe he thought he heard leather and not wood and he didn't call this a foul ball. And that's why everyone just thought the count was three and two because he called this a ball, which would make it two and two. And then you got all the foul balls and then eventually the walk because no one reacted. After the game, they asked Gio, did you know you walked on three pitches? And he said that he knew, but nobody else knew. And I think it's because Gio is the only person that knew that that pitch hit his bat and no one else did. So congrats to Gio Urshela, you know, really good secret by him. Didn't hit my bat, didn't hit my bat. I'm on first.